Hey, what's going on, y'all? This is Jay Damage back again with another video. And uh, today I wanted to talk to you guys about Instagram uh, graphic design scammers. So basically, I've talked about this before, but I guess I can cover a little bit more ground with this video. So basically, what goes on is there's like a lot of Instagram graphic design scammers running around all over the internet. They're inboxing people. They all over your comment section. They constantly telling you to inbox them. They're posting these weird comments with these long lists, you know, of all these, you know, graphic design services they can offer you. But then, you know, they scamming people through all these fake profiles. So this is my thing. If you are contacted by someone who the, the profile just seems sketchy. It seems like a girl or dude. And um, they have a whole bunch of designs all over their page. They don't even have pictures of themselves. They have a whole bunch of pic uh, pictures of designs. And they're inboxing you and they're consistently asking you, hey, you know, buy this or buy that. Like, if it seems too good to be true, it probably isn't true. One of the first things I want you to do as soon as you get a message like that is start doing your research. That's the first thing you should do. If anybody contacts you and offers you to buy any type of service, the first thing you need to do is, is research them. So... Uh, one thing I want you guys to do is, as soon as those people inbox you, you know, literally just start questioning them. Just start questioning their service, how long, how long they've been in service. Start asking them about different things about graphic design. And usually, most of the time, once you start doing that, you'll start noticing that these people aren't real. And the wild thing about it is, most of the time, a lot of these people that are running these scams, they're not even from. You know, they don't even speak your language. They don't even speak English. So if you just speak to them long enough, you'll understand that they're not. But this is the weird thing that happened to me. So in one of my Instagram profiles, uh, you know, one of my burner accounts, because I, I wasn't using my main account. So I got contacted out of nowhere one day from this guy who basically is like, hey, you know, basically trying to, you know, sell me some designs. So, you know, I'm about to do my usual, just block them and not even talk to them. So I goes on his page and he has my designs. <laughs> and I'm thinking to myself, like, this dude doesn't even know he's trying to sell me, me. <laughs> so what I did was I ended up inboxing him. I started talking to him and I just started asking him questions. And lo and behold, he ended up getting on the phone with me. And the crazy thing is, is while he was on the phone with me, he ended up eventually like... Uh, I, well, I ended up eventually telling him that those were my designs on his page and he hung up on me. But I say that to say this, be careful of who you're dealing with because this guy I was speaking to was extremely convincing. Like if, if like when I talked to him, he was telling me, you know, he's been doing this for a long time. He's done designs for a lot of people. He just got done doing the design. And if I send him, he was saying some amount. If I send him some amount, he could just jump right on the design and start working on it. But he's busy right now and I need to hurry up. It was a whole strategy of the way that he was going to scam me. And it tripped me out because I was like, if a person didn't know you know, the way that this works, then they would never even know uh, about this type of scam. So that's my thing. If you end up seeing something like this and, you know, I would say, you know, warn your family members, warn your friends, warn everybody that, you know, whenever you see somebody running this type of scam. And most of the time I'm telling you, anytime somebody is running this type of scam it's always through a profile that's sketchy. They, there's never nothing legit. There is always a profile that hasn't even been up long. And it's just a whole bunch of random designs. One of the one of the main ways that you can always tell that a, a graphic designer is not real is if you go look at their designs and the designs are not consistent. Like one thing, like if you go to my page or you go to most graphic designers pages, you will notice that the designs, every designer kind of has like their own like type of look. Like if you look at my designs, you can see there is almost like this consistent type of cartoon look. There's a, a consistent type of logo look. Like if you go to uh, Chi World's uh, page, you can see that every design on his page is designed in a certain type of way. These vectorized designs are, you know, are, are placed together in a certain type of way where you can tell that he created it. And that's the thing. If you go to their page and all of their designs just seem super duper random, then you should automatically be like, something isn't right about this. So what I'm going to do right quick is kind of show you guys this little video of this guy contacting me and me having a conversation with him about these things in the way that he was talking to me and how it was so convincing and how if you don't pay attention, a person could really scam you. Mm -hmm. 
I'm okay. I'm 40 with a car soon. I just finished up two clients. I've been up since 6 in the morning, so I just finished two clients. They got their four logos done, and then they added a character, or they got a, they turned themselves to a cartoon, and then I put their business logo under it as well. So it's all okay. with the package deal today. But by itself, it's $60. But today, and only today, it's the only package I'm doing is 4 for 40 with a cartoon. Wow. The I'm I'm not I'm not gonna lie to you, like that's a that's a dope price, man. Like like you you probably the only person that's doing these this cheap. Okay. Yeah, I work with a lot of people, wait, 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 wait. You said you said you worked in the cookies magazine? Uh you said what you said you worked in the cookies magazine. You did designs for them? Hold up, wait, wait, you did the cookies logo? The cookies logo, my dude. I gave Burner five different cookies. I worked with uh, the mechanics, like a lot of people from the Bay Area. And then uh, back in 2012. Boy, I, if you don't. Uh, I don't do that scamming stuff and stuff like that, you know, that's, that's way out of my league, man. I have a family to take care of, but, you know, I give them my yeah. personal number. This is my personal number. You can contact me whenever you want, you know. Oh, right, this is your personal number, the one I called you on? Okay. Well, um, I, I actually uh, have something to tell you, man, because I got a lot of money. And um, I just wanted to let you know, bro, that uh, you're lying right now. <laughs> the way that I know you're lying because uh, some of these designs that you have are mine. Do you know who you're speaking to right now? No, I do not. Uh, you're speaking to Jay Damage. Wait, who is this? This is the designer, Jay Damage. And some of the designs on your page are mine. Wait, who, oh wait, your name is Jay Damage? Uh, yeah, the designer. Can I look you up right now? Go ahead. You have my designs on your page right now. And uh, I just wanted to ask you just a quick question. Why are you lying? That's crazy, right? See, that's the thing. You might be watching something like that and you may even be like, man, I wouldn't get scammed by that. But sometimes you never know. You never know. Sometimes a person's friendliness will throw you off. They'll end up scamming you, running off with your money and you know, they'll just be off. They'll block you and they often get catch the next victim. So if you guys get a chance, make sure you share this video uh, with with the people you know and let them know that right now there are a lot of people scamming with this graphic design stuff and make sure if you are to get you know some designs done like let's say for your business for your club you know for your mixtape cover whatever it is make sure if you are getting getting a design done make sure you properly do your research and nine times out of ten if I would say find somebody that you're comfortable with that you know that kind of li that's local lives around you and kind of just stick with that person. I know even sometimes y'all may even be seeing some people you may not even like their designs. I would look if anything I would say try to find somebody that you're comfortable with. Once you find someone that you're comfortable with stick with that person because right now we are dealing with a very very scam scamdemic. <laughs> so uh yeah so basically yeah that's really all i have for this video i kind of just wanted to keep y'all aware of what's going on and kind of separate myself too because i wanted to let y'all know i'm not with the bullshit when it come down to scamming so yeah i appreciate y'all for checking out this video and i'll see y'all in the next one peace